Hello! Welcome! Today's video looks at how to get the new update of Windows 10 for 2016 that came out on the 2nd of August. It's called the Anniversary Update. Okay, now many people are finding they go to Windows Update, they're still stuck on version 1511 or even lower. You keep clicking on check for updates and nothing ever happens. Okay, it just keeps updating your Defender or something else and then you never get the proper update. So what we're going to see over here is how to actually get it. Okay, if you were to go to Google, Windows 10 ISO, that brings you to the Microsoft website. Okay, and you click on that, you go forward, and over here you will see right at the top it says update now we're going to show you two different ways of how to update okay click on the update now okay and that should download this windows 10 upgrade kind of like tool shall we say okay okay and then that basically downloads this tool okay so we're just going to close out of settings as that never works okay and we'll just run this okay there we go we click yes and what it will do it'll do a little system test okay to make sure one that you have at least 20 gigs of hard disk space available and two that your edition and version etc of windows 10 comes within the boundaries okay so basically then click update now it says cpu okay memory okay disk space okay click next okay and then what it's going to do it'll take time um depending on how fast your internet speed is etc it'll download That'll become 100%, then it'll basically update, it'll go from 0 to 100% again, then I think it restarts your computer, and then you have the latest version of Windows 10, which is 1607. Okay, we're actually going to cancel this update, okay, and show you another way to do it. Okay, we're going to go back to Edge, okay, go back to Google. Okay, and go back to the same website. Okay, so we type in Windows 10 ISO. Okay, it's the very first thing over here, and it's make sure it's from Microsoft, not any of the others. Okay, so that was one way of doing it. Another way is to go the slightly longer way, but this should also help you in case the first way did that. Okay. So we're just gonna now run this. This is basically the media tool. Okay. And we can close out of that. What this does is it will basically give you an update or even the option to save it as an ISO and then you can or burn it to a DVD and then you can manually update it or it'll do the update on its own automatically okay it does take a little bit of time to get ready okay you accept the license and then we come to the screen where it says upgrade this PC now, or you have the option to create installation media for another PC. Okay, um, upgrade this PC now, click next. Okay, now basically what will happen is this will then download the Windows 10 bits and just keep clicking ahead and it will upgrade your pc you will have to restart and it'll sort it out so these are the two main methods of basically updating your computer to windows 10 anniversary edition if 
it does not work the normal way using settings and then update okay if that was not working then these two methods should work don't forget if you are on like volume licenses or if you are in the enterprise version that will not work this way you also basically want to if you are on the education version okay so it's okay let's just do that okay if you do need the education version okay what you do need to do is actually not this update now tool okay but you need to go to more download options and then it's the academic version software that you will need okay so basically once you have your product key okay you can then download the tool and use that so hopefully this has helped thank you for watching